Hello and welcome to my channel. Please like, share, and subscribe if you like this video. And thank you all so much for watching. Thank you, thank you, thank you to my day ones, twos, and threes. Thank you to all my new subscribers that's coming in that means well. Thank you so very much. I appreciate you all. And welcome, welcome, welcome. This video is for entertainment and educational purposes only. So everything is alleged, some is not. And the fair act use is in my description box, y'all. So let's get to it, y'all. Let's get to it. Y'all, word on the street is there is a break in Young Dolph's case, y'all. Word on the street. Y'all, it is going down in Memphis right now, y'all. And ain't no joke. It is not no joke, y'all. Um, at the same time that this is very, very sad. This is also, I'm excited about this. Because finally, Dolph is about to get some justice, y'all. He is finally about to to get some justice word on the street is y'all <laughs> boy oh boy 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 y'all i have to pull out my numbers and everything for this because i remember doing this before i did this before and i pulled out the numbers and all of this stuff um lord have mercy <sighs> word on the street is they raided Dolphland grocery store, y'all. Word on the street. And Costelia. Okay. And they picked up 10 people. And mind you, this is a place where Snoop bands be at all the time. This is his spot. Okay. Where he just be it. Okay, y'all. And y'all remember, especially my day ones, twos, and threes. Y'all remember back here when I did the numbers on Snoop bands. And I put his name in a gematria. And when I put his name in Dematria, Snoop Bands, 888 popped up. And remember when I was telling y'all about he was a part of that brotherhood that helped line Adolf up? My personal opinion. Well, I guess the numbers don't lie once again. Because word on the street is, them 10 guys that they picked up, y'all, and even before they picked them up. They talking, y'all. They singing. Like Whitney Houston. They are singing, y'all. I promise y'all. Word on the street. Okay? Y'all are not going to believe what I am hearing right now. I'm not there, so I can't just say, oh, this is 100, 100, 100. But I can, I can say it's coming from a reliable source. And I can say this, y'all. That this talking that's coming up right now, they're saying, y'all. That Snoop bands played a part. Y'all, they said they had the marshals, the feds, the CIA, everybody there. Everything was on lockdown around up in there. And y'all remember that Snoop bands was the ones that was saying that Dolph called him a couple times that morning. He didn't answer because he was getting his hair cut. Well, <clears throat> y'all not going to believe this. But word on the street is that's where they got Dolph at. This is what they're saying. This is what they're saying. Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy. They about to finally get some justice for Dolph, y'all. They're saying this is where he met up at. And this makes me think about the other snake. That um grape guy. Remember I was telling y'all that he got a lot to say but nothing really. And he was talking about that he met up with Dolph in an undisclosed place and this and that and that and this. And then y'all see how um, when people were supposed to be at certain places passing out turkeys, they just left the place and started passing out turkeys in the middle of the street. As if they was going to do whatever they wanted to do, Dolph was gone. They act like they already knew Dolph was gone, y'all. And I'm going to tell y'all this. If this is true what I am hearing, because word on the street, it is going the F down right now, y'all. 
And they say, this has all to do with Dolph, why that place just got raided. Because of the people that helped line Dolph up. And they're saying, y'all, Lord have mercy, that this where Dolph was taken at. He was not taken where they say he was taken at and all this other stuff that they've been putting out. They're saying now that Dolph was taken there. Word on the street. They say he was getting a haircut, y'all. He was getting a haircut. He came there to get a haircut over there. And that's when his own boys took him to the ops, y'all. Y'all remember when I just told y'all? I just told y'all a little while ago. I said, Puff Daddy is snitching. Why y'all think he's still out here on the streets, y'all? I told y'all this. And when I told y'all about the hat and it was connecting to Jay-Z and this and that and that and this, Dolph owned people. And this got to tell y'all this. If if this is true what they're saying, that Dolph was taken because he was going there to get a haircut, he was supposed to meet people there, and Big Moochie Grape, didn't he say he was going to an undisclosed place? Was that the undisclosed place he was talking about? And on his own turf, y'all. On his own turf, his own voice handed him over to the ops, y'all. His own people that he was looking out for. Remember, I told y'all. I told y'all. When that 888 popped up in Snoop Band's numbers, I said he was a part of that so-called brotherhood. He was trying to take his next step up. And it makes sense now. Everything makes all the sense. Dolph would have let his guards down there. Y'all, this is ridiculous. <clears throat> and I'm hearing also that Raven is next. Word on the street. They're coming to get her too. Because this lets you know that what they call themselves, they say went down, that was supposed to have went down at Makita's. That they showed us, you know, them pictures and this and that. That, oh, these two guys came to the window. I told y'all. I told y'all. When that hat connection came out, they ain't had no choice but to start talking. They ain't had no choice. Why would you be wearing Bass Pro Shop hat? And, 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 and I'm just saying, y'all, Jay-Z part owner. And he was doing business with him. This was promotion all day long. All of this stuff was like, I told y'all. I told y'all. And word on the street is Jay-Z and Beyonce called Lisa trying to find them a place out the country now, y'all. I told y'all a shitaka is about to hit the fan. I told y'all. And just like what the guys say. When he get ready to clean house, he got to clean his own house first. They cleaning Dolph's house now. Because the people around him help hand him over to the ops, y'all. They ain't just pop out. This was all planned. This is why they had Big Moochie Grapes. Had the first turkey drive. They had this all planned out. Whoever even put the, made the plans for what Dolph was supposed to do while he was there. Everybody played a part in this mess, y'all. And if that's the case, Lord help it. But I kept saying, why is the family so quiet? I kept saying this. And people was like, Miss Lowdown, um, so are you saying that Dolph Brother had played a part in this? It, other than that, it makes no sense. How is you chasing a car that's right in front of you with the what 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 you had in your hand and ain't nobody get hit? Ain't no way. Some people were saying he was hitting in the air. He wasn't even trying to hit that car. It was all a play, y'all. All a play. And I was telling y'all the night before. I did not. Y'all, Lord have mercy. Oh, my God. Y'all. Mm, mm, mm. I told y'all they did the same thing they did to Mo3. They recorded they recorded what happened. They threw a party afterwards and watched the film. I told y'all. They did the same thing they did. They thought they could do this to Mo3. And then they was like, we, we got away with that. So they thought, so we going to do it to Dolph. But they wasn't expecting things to go down the way it's going down, y'all. Okay? They wasn't expecting that. They wasn't expecting Puff Daddy to go down and say, I ain't going down by myself. I'm going to give y'all something what y'all want. 
They wasn't expecting all of that. Word on the street is, um, Puff Daddy is into it with Jay-Z now. He mad at them now. Everybody is snake, 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 and snakes. Didn't I tell y'all that was coming up in the numbers? Snakes, snake, and snakes, y'all. Lord have mercy. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Mm, mm, mm. They are saying that he was taken at that spot, y'all. This is why that place was raided. Word on the street, y'all. It ain't had nothing to do with no street pharmacy stuff and all of that stuff. If that was there, they, they just got that too. But word on the street is, that's where they set off up at. This is what they're saying to me. The streets is talking, y'all. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm, mm. Dolph was running around and helping everybody. Trying to teach his artists how to be independent. And at the same time, he was trying to make a way for them to make a way for their families. They were trying to join the brotherhood, y'all. So they could be popular with... I'm just going to put it out there, y'all. Word on the street. Um, uh, J to the Z now, okay? And CMG now. They was trying to be popular with them. They figured that they was about to get their stripes. Go up the ladder. Strip up. How could you do some mess like this? Do they know what they did, y'all? This man was helping everybody. Everybody. And like I told you, they're saying Raven is next. This is what I'm hearing. That she's going to be arrested. She is going down with the rest of them, y'all. They're talking. They said they sang it like Whitney Houston, y'all. Mm, mm, mm. Y'all, I told y'all. One thing I told y'all was they was not. There's no way that people like Mo3 and Dolph can rest. People, I know people be like, rest in peace and this and that. They spirits can't rest when they get lined up like that and then get set up by people that they was helping. Ain't no way you gonna rest until everybody go down that played a part. Mm, mm, mm. Lord have mercy. I cannot believe this mess. I mean, it wasn't nobody that came to Dolph that he did not help. Nobody. If somebody was about to lose their house, he helped them. If somebody was having problems about with their stores, their businesses, he helped them. People tell me if people needed diapers, he went and bought diapers for people. They weren't even his kids, y'all. Put clothes on people back, paid their bills like he was paying his own family members' bills. And this is what these dirty mothers did to him. And I told y'all, I told y'all from the beginning, I said some don't ain't right about that Snoop Bands. And I'm so excited right now that I'm hearing the news that I'm hearing. Like I told y'all, I said, I, I was looking up Snoop Band's name. And if y'all know his real name, put it in the comment, in, in the comment section right now. Because I'm going to put this video on up so y'all can know what's going on. But word on the street is, this is what I heard, y'all. This is what I heard. That, um, and I bet you, y'all, I bet you Raven, I bet you Raven, I bet you Dolph Brother, all of them is shaking in their boots right now. They're shaking, they're scared, y'all. Best believe that. They are scared. This is what they're saying. Mm, mm, mm. They're saying that's where Dolph came up missing at. From getting a haircut, y'all. He went down in Castalia and his own boys handed him over to the ops. This is what they're saying, y'all. They had the dogs out and everything. And word on the street is, her raven is next, y'all. They all know now what's how stuff went down and everything. Didn't I tell y'all when you found out about that hat? I, I told y'all. I said, watch now. There's going to be some heads going to be turning right now, y'all. They got a major, major player. Even though Puffy name was nothing around this situation. But 
due to the fact that Puffy is so close to Jay-Z. This is why they into it right now. Y'all can pull up videos right now. People is talking about that Jay-Z and, and um, Puffy is mad at each other. They not even talking right now. They peed off at each other. Okay? They not even talking. And the reason being is because Puffy is telling, y'all. This is why Puffy has not been arrested. This is all they needed, y'all. Only thing they had to do was go to that jail and talk to Straight Drop. Why did you wear, choose to wear that hat that you had on? And then on top of wearing that hat, you turn around and did a video while you were on the run? And you started the video off with Bass Pro Shop. As if you were doing a commercial for them, y'all. This is how sick in the mind that people are in this industry. This is why they felt like they can go to these meetings in the courthouse and demand for them to pass laws that they, they can't use nothing against you that people are putting in the videos. Because they like to taunt passings in the videos. Somebody said this in my comment section. They said the um these numbers is going to be their downfall because they like to line up stuff out of numbers. I just said this in the other video I just did about Beyonce. Don't be surprised when Beyonce's name started ringing too, y'all. She had already had her dancers wearing Michael Jackson colors before Michael Jackson was taken out, y'all. She was already prepared. And they already knew that Michael was about to be taken out. I did the video, what, last year sometime? And I told y'all, watch and see when all of this started lining up. And here we are, y'all. Here we are. They are saying, and word on the street, you know, some people's telling me they think they got snoo bands because they got 10 people that they, they, they arrested. And they said they sang it. They talking, y'all. They scared out of their minds right now. And they, they wasn't prepared. To go to get caught up. And then the questions started coming at them. They didn't think that the feds was going to know. A lot of stuff. But they knew already a lot of stuff. They had no choice but to let it out. Just like Straight Drop didn't have no choice but to say. They told me to wear that hat. I was instructed to put that in the front of that video. And I'm going to tell y'all this. How in the world could he edit the video. And do all of this stuff while he was on the run. They all told Straight Drop to put that Pro Shop stuff in there. They didn't think that people was going to put this piece of the puzzle together. Y'all, this is the downfall of a, 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 a nice downfall of an organization that should have been out of here a long time ago. They've been taking people out for a long time, allegedly, since way back when Tupac got taken out. The same circle of people. Look who was in the booth with Bone Thugs and Harmony. Now, right after Easy e got taken out, y'all. Y'all think that wasn't done on purpose? I keep telling y'all this. This is an organization that's been going on for a long time. But all of a sudden, now snakes are snaking snakes. Remember when I just told y'all about Takeoff? And that um, Jay-Z was already looking for an excuse to take Takeoff out because he was peed off about him letting a cat out the bag that he did not write that song Ape Shittica, okay? And that he wrote it. And he recorded Beyonce and um, Jay-Z in the studio practicing the song, trying to get it down pat. What he wrote, okay, y'all? I guess Jay-Z didn't want it to lie and say that he wrote it and get it in, in, in and take all the credit for it. But um, take off, let everybody know, no, nah, I'm the one that wrote this. Okay? And Jaguar Wright, she just came out. She even started saying the same thing I was saying. But she didn't say exactly that. But she did say that Jay-Z and them had something to do. She said it was a what? A take a takedown? They've been saying this for a long time. That it was, a you know, a, a takedown. What what did she say? What did what did Jaguar Wright say, y'all? She just did um an interview. Cause I kind of took notes somewhere. I forget. I remember. I, somebody sent me the interview, and I was like, she's saying the same somewhat what you said. 
You said that Jay-Z and them had to play the part. And now Jaguar Wright is saying the same thing. She's saying the same exact stuff you said, Miss Lowdown. This is what they said to me. And they sent the pay. They sent it to me. And I said, here we go. And I told y'all when that snake, snake, and snakes was coming up. Now everybody is snaking each other. Everybody is trying to figure out what to do, what to say, how to say it, what to do, when to do it. Everybody is turning on each other now. Y'all don't, they scared. Believe that. They scared. They are scared. They don't know what to do right now. Seriously. I forgot what she said. I don't even know what I did with the paper, y'all. She said it was hostile takeover. This is what she said. And she said it has something to do with Megan Thee Stallion, too. And I believe her. I believe her. Because you know what? It makes sense. They tricked. And I've told you these guys been working together for the longest. I said, Jay-Z and them was working, pretending like they don't get along with certain people. But behind closed doors, they was having meetings and certain rappers get taken out. When they want them out of there, they, they get them out of there. My personal opinion. This is what I said to y'all. Because if you follow everything that they, excuse me, have been doing. I told y'all this a long time ago, y'all. A long time ago, I said the same people was in the same circle. And now look at it coming full circle right now. Right after Takeoff was taken out, just like Jaguar Rice said, Megan Thee Stallion got released from all of those people that she was fighting for for the longest. They were fighting her back and forth in court. Y'all remember this, right? They were fighting Megan Thee Stallion. They did not want to release her from her contracts. But as soon as Takeoff got taken out, she was released from everything. They used it as leverage. So basically, this is what it sounded like they did. They got Mob Task now, Jay Prince now, to line up Takeoff. This is what they did. Allegedly, allegedly, allegedly. This is what it seemed like. This is what it sounded like what was coming from her. And from what I heard about, he didn't like Takeoff anyway. So this was a plus plus. This was a plus plus for Jay-Z now. Okay. Not only was it a hostile takeoff, but he was wanted him anyway. Because his little tail recorded him and Beyonce <laughs> at the same time. He already had some animosity. So you get your number one alleged hitter. that always lining people up and getting away with it. Allegedly, 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 Jay Prince now. They line this child up. Halloween. They did about the numbers too, y'all. Get, get Quavo to bring them here. And then have them drop that video before it happens. Everybody going to be talking about it. Then they wore the fisherman hat. So they was representing the Bass Pro Shop stuff too. They had their fisherman stuff on too, remember? And I, I said this in a video. I said, why in the world would you wear some fisherman clothes on your birthday? You want to get geared up. You want to be looking nice. Why in the world you want to represent fisherman hats, y'all? Why would you wear going fishing on your birthday? This is what the birthday boy had on. Okay, y'all. And I said this, I said this, I said this. It makes no sense. But they tricked him, y'all. They tricked him to take out takeoff. And after they took out takeoff, they had leverage on J. Prince. This is how I feel. This is my personal opinion. They had leverage on them. And after they had that leverage on them, okay, now we're going to use this leverage on them to get them to release Megan Thee Stallion. Because at first, Jay-Z was just managing her. But now, Jay-Z owns her. Okay, y'all? He took Megan from 300 and Jay Prince now. That's why they had to sign that paperwork over. You took her out. I got some leverage on you. Let her go. And y'all see that $300, $300 million check? They sold quality control right after takeoff was taken out. They sold it to some people in Korea. And I'm going to tell y'all this. I do believe that, and this is my personal opinion, because I told y'all this a long time ago when all them people had passed away in Korea and all this stuff, and all them people that was laid out on the ground, they had on those covers, and they had bumblebees all over it. I said, y'all, this is trip, 
I said, no. And I started doing some research on it. And she, Beyonce got ties down there in Korea. Why, why y'all think that quality control got sold to some Koreans? Because you know what? They sit around that table. My personal opinion would a J to the Z now that has ties in Korea. And they sold it to them. They got that money for them. And everything worked itself out for everybody. Okay, y'all? Everybody. This is why Quavo running around talking about just let him rest in peace. And then since now that he didn't get called out. And his career is over with basically because he can't even sell out a concert. And people running around talking about Chris Brown bought out the, the, the stadium and this and that. Chris Brown wouldn't put no money in his pockets. He couldn't sell out them stadiums because after they saw him for what he really was, a nobody, a lame. Because Chris Brown let the cat out the bag. He came with it on him. And he had, I, I don't know that y'all hear it. I don't know that y'all hear that mess that he called himself came back on Chris Brown with. But I laughed till I couldn't laugh no more. Okay, y'all? But all of this is connected. Every last bit of this. Even Mo 3 when he got taken out. This, these the same circle of people that was around. Dolph was around him. Okay, y'all? JoJo Splat, all of them was talking about Splat and all of this stuff when Mo3 was on, on the expressway. Oh, yeah. All of them been connected. I told y'all this. I told y'all. I told. I was the first one that was out here singing it. Asked my day ones, twos, and threes. I said, this is connected to Dallas. I knew it. I knew it. I was the first one that said it. And everybody was like, oh, she crazy. But, but look, look what happened later. Everybody started singing the same tune, y'all. I told y'all. I told y'all it was about to go down. Didn't I tell y'all? And it's going down now. Now they're cleaning house. They're cleaning house. Now they're getting down to the gusto. Now they're getting down to the nitty gritty, y'all. Of who helped line Dolph up. Who passed him over to the ops. Now they're getting down to the nitty gritty. And word on the street is, Snoop Band's name is all over the place. It's ringing on these streets. This is what they're saying. He was the one of the main culprits. And the other one, that grapey guy, grapey, grapes. The fruit man, y'all. The grapes. Word on the street. This is what I'm hearing. And I am not surprised. Same thing that happened with Mo3. People that was close to him that he thought that he could trust. You mean to tell me the very person that Mo3 let know where he keep his weapon at in his car. That was the very person that allegedly took the weapon out of his car. So when they came for Mo3 and he was looking for his weapon. It wasn't even there because his right hand man left him out here vulnerable. Okay, y'all, just like Dolph, right-hand man, the people that he was helping left him vulnerable, too. So they can be with, you know, down with the click, the brotherhood. They didn't think this was all going to blow up in their faces, y'all. This Rico is about to be off the, the chain, y'all. But I'm about to stop right here so I can post this video up so let y'all know what's going on. But word on the street is they said that Dolph was there getting a haircut. That's where he got taken. They took him at. Okay? And it makes sense now. Big Moochie Grape didn't want to tell nobody nothing. Oh, we he I met him in an undisclosed place. You ain't meet him in an undisclosed place. You met him where you met him at. So they could grab him. You was one of the ones, I do believe, and it's my personal opinion, I'm going to say allegedly, he was one of the ones that was there when they grabbed off, y'all. When they grabbed him. And see, they didn't got a little taste of having money now, y'all. So this is another reason why they sang it like Whitney Houston, okay? They scared because they don't know how much time about to get through at them for lining this man up, okay, y'all? Boy, oh boy, I bet Joe, uh, yo got in them shaking in their boots right now. I bet Dolph's brother is shaking in his boots right now. I knew it. I told y'all, I told y'all. 
every family that didn't, somebody didn't passed away that I know of or, or heard of in the industry and stuff like that, the family be beefing. Dolph got a huge family. He got people all around him. And nobody's beefing over his money. You know why? Because everybody's satisfied. And the ones that didn't have anything to do with it, which is probably very little, family members that didn't have anything to do with it, that really loved this man, they didn't, they didn't know about it. Because the people that lined him up around him, they made sure, don't let that person know because she going to let them know. Well, he going to let him know. You know, Dolph got them in his back pocket, so don't let them know about it. It's certain ones that they chose. And for them to say what they're saying right now, that Dolph was taken there in Costelia, I hope I'm saying it right, y'all. This lets you know his brother helped play a part. This why they so quiet. How you gonna have a name like Demon? That's what his, his, his brother that was supposed to be with him. That's his nickname, right? How you gonna have a name like Demon? That means that the streets gave you that name. That means you've been out here doing some dirt. You've been, you been getting it in, okay? How you gonna have that name and you ain't out here representing for your brother? Ain't no way in the world. Anybody that I knew back in the hood that had names like that, <laughs> you touch one of their brothers, you best believe that it was gonna be some. <laughs> That was going to snap. It was going to go down. His brother quiet as a mouse. You know why? Because now the truth is coming out, y'all. The truth is coming out. And everything is lining up like it's supposed to be lined up perfectly, y'all. Okay? It's sad because Dolph kids got to grow up and... and, and the truth gonna come out one way or the other. Why you think Dolph son is so mad right now, y'all? Why you think he got so much anger in him? I pray for that baby. I pray for his daughter. They got so much built up anger in them. And I can't, I cannot give Mia no leeway. Because Mia J, y'all had to agree with the cookie shop to let them even sell the Dolph cookies and they cookies. Because if... They didn't want them selling no Dolph cookies. They wouldn't sell no Dolph cookies. How in the world do the cookie people, and they saying she's next, that raven. How in the world do the cookie people make a deal with your baby mama? And they all cool with each other. Even if I didn't know if she had something to do with it or not, until I found out for surely sure, Ain't no way she could be in my face. Ain't no way she could be selling my man cookies in my man's name. None of that stuff. I be suing Makita's cookies, y'all. The truth is coming out now. And ain't nothing they can do about it. They can run to the White House, do whatever it is that they want to. But everything is coming out now. And it's too many heads right now that's involved. So ain't no covering all of this stuff up anymore. Ain't no more. Just like that police that got taken out. With black youngsters. A cousin. All of this stuff is tied. In one shape or form somehow. Okay y'all. This man was at Dolph's. The scene of the crime. And he just got hit in the face y'all. They took this man's face off. His own people. Those boys was running. They didn't even hit at them. They was hitting at the, the boys. And turned around and put it in his face. That police officer. Was that police officer talking y'all? That's the question. And if you did take him out. He had to tell somebody. I told y'all heads was about to turn, didn't I? And they was going to get down to the nitty gritty about Dolph, okay? We are there now, y'all. Now it's coming to their houses. His, his own inner circle. It's coming to their face now. Snoop Ben's name is ringing all over the police station right now. Word on the street, y'all. That they helped line Dolph up. 
why Dolph was getting a haircut, y'all. A haircut? What better way to get somebody on their own turf, sitting down, relaxed, probably got his eyes closed. Why he getting a haircut, y'all? So who was cutting his hair? Did he tell too? Is he talking? The barber? Because it's all coming out now, y'all. It's all coming out now. And if he was getting a haircut, was he getting a haircut with Snoop Bands? Because Snoop Bands said that he was getting a haircut too. Didn't he, y'all? Or was that just an excuse that he used for that day? Because they already had their little lie lined up on what they was going to say they was doing this day and that day and that day and that day. Y'all, it's about to go down. Stay tuned, y'all. Stay tuned. Anyway, y'all, please like, share, and subscribe if you liked the video. And thanks for watching, y'all. Snakes is snaking snakes all over the place. Okay, y'all? Peace.